Hey guys, it's me, My Reborns, and I am back with another video. Today is Wednesday, May 4th, and it's currently 6.41 p.m., and I have Eileen for you guys. I know, awkward angle. It's a horrible angle. I didn't feel like bringing on my tripod if I'm being 100% completely honest with you guys. I literally did not feel like bringing on my tripod for this video. So, um, you have makeshift tripod. I might pick you guys up a little later if I start, if I, like, start to get annoyed with that angle. But, um, maybe I can actually put you guys on something else. We have Eileen here, though. And I'm going to be doing a quick video with her. I am going to start pre-recording videos either today or tomorrow. I'm kind of out of it today. I'm not feeling too well. So, um, I might just pre-film the rest of my videos tomorrow. Okay, this one, this angle's not too bad, is it? Eh, it's not horrible, but it's not great either. Anywho, I am going to start pre-filming the rest of my videos tomorrow. I don't like that her head's cut off. And don't worry, guys, I am going to be changing Eilina very soon. I know she's been in this for a while. Looks like she's about to fall. She's like, yes, do we have a problem? <laughs> okay, so... I do have a topic for today's video and this was a topic that I was actually going to save for my pre-film videos but I actually wanted to talk about it now. Also I am uploading this video on Friday and so that means that today aka Friday is the last day for you all to purchase a baby of mine. I have been trying to get them sold. I don't know. Thank you to everyone who's given me suggestions. However, all of the suggestions that I have gotten, I've already done. The only one that I haven't done, which was a really great suggestion, was from Queen Bee Babies and stuff. Go subscribe to her. She's holding a free Reborn Baby Doll giveaway once she gets to 500 subscribers. So, go subscribe to her. She had gave me a suggestion. Um, she told me to take one of my dolls that i'm selling out with like little business cards that way like if i get reactions and somebody won one i can hand them business cards so they can contact me that's really smart unfortunately i just wasn't allowed to take them out in enough time especially with everything going on right now so i wasn't able to take them out but that's a really really good tip and i'm definitely gonna be using that for the future so thank you quick little video update before i get started with the topic i will be only posting quick video update quick channel update i don't know if i said that quick channel update i will be posting starting on the 14th i'll be posting every saturday and if i happen to record more videos then i'll post probably on that sunday or that wednesday or something but don't be don't be alarmed when you guys only see me post once a week don't be alarmed i'm gonna be posting to the 14th the 21st the 28th the 4th the 11th the 18th the 25th and the second i'm gonna be posting all of those saturdays and if i happen to record more than eight videos then I will start posting either on Wednesday or Sunday. But that will be randomly depending on how many extra videos I have to post. But my plan is just to post every Saturday until July 2nd. Again, don't be alarmed. Don't be like, why isn't Maya making any videos? What happened? Why are you only recording on Saturday? That is why. Or only posting on Saturday. By the way, all of that is going to be pre-filmed. So even in June, those videos are going to be pre-filmed. My topic for today is how to afford a reborn baby doll. And I think I did this video before. If I did, I did it like once or twice before. But I wanted to make an updated one because I found out other ways to afford one. And I do have a how to make money to be able to afford a reborn baby doll. I did that video last year. Go check it out. Alright, so this is going to be a very short video. Okay, I know. I keep talking. How to afford a reborn baby doll. Like a solution. Paint one yourself. Painting a baby yourself is probably one of the cheapest things you can do. You can buy a, I'm not going to lie, Bountiful Baby has been having some really, really good sales. And mind you guys, I don't get promoted to say anything that I say on my channel. I don't get paid the same thing I say on my channel. All of this is me speaking, all of this is authentic. They've been having some really good sales lately. Like I bought a kit for like $18 and it was a seconds kit but there was literally nothing wrong with the kit so if you catch them on sale you can literally get an authentic reborn baby doll for $18 $20 $25 $30 you know so you just catch them on sale don't buy a full price <laughs> um, I like to catch my bountiful baby 
kits on sale just because I know they are on sale so it's kind of like a two-in-one like what kind of like why would I pay full price when I know it's gonna be on sale sometime soon so that's my first suggestion just pay one yourself oh so if you buy the kit and you buy it from Brown for baby and it's on sale for like $18 then you know like $10 for shipping so about $28 for the kit and then just buy the paint and a lot of you guys are switching over to acrylic paint anyways or the ultimate fusion paint so that's even cheaper than the genesis and you know like i will say all of this costs less than $200 depending on which route you take. Because there's many different routes you can take. I would say painting your own reborn will cost you under $200 if not under like $100, $150. The second one is this one. And I just, not found this out, but I just, this just came to me a couple of months ago. Buy a blank kit and put it together until you can pay to get it painted or until you can paint it yourself. If you buy a $100 kit from MacPherson, keep that kit until you're able to afford to get it painted. And I know you guys are like, well, what if I wanna hold it? What if I wanna snuggle? Clothes, put the baby on the body, stuff the baby up. You don't even have to weigh the arms or the legs with glass beads. They can be weightless. Just stuff the body up and then put the baby together on either the strings or the zip ties. And then there you have your cuddleness, your cuddle factor, and boom, you can dress your baby. Well, what if I want to take pictures? You can take pictures. Put the picture in black and white. They're never going to know if the baby is painted or not. That's probably the best thing that I ever like thought of and came up with. To buy a blank kit, put it together, and boom. I know it's not realistic, but that's just another way you can afford an authentic reborn if you... um are like low on money and you really want one another one is an alternative reborn paradise galleries ashton drake can be dows those you can find for about 70 dollars depending on which one you get at most maybe like 200 but you can definitely find them for under a hundred dollars especially paradise galleries dows they have been having sales on their dows so like i've seen one on there for like 59 dollars when it was on sale so just check on their page they'll usually announce when they have a sale or you can sign up for text or emails and they'll let you know when they when they have a sale yes they're not hand painted they are manufactured but they're still really really cute my next tip is to purchase from a beginner artist now you will have to go out and find your own artist who is a beginner that's not a scam i might get a like a list of reputable artists and let you, and share that with you guys so no one gets scammed if you want me to do that let me know i have to definitely take some time and do the research for that but if you buy from beginner artists they're most likely going to sell their work for cheap there's a lot of beginner artists who sell their work for cheap and they even do affordable customs like $50 kit paintings so you buy the kit again I'm using Battle for Baby as an example because they are the cheapest site that I know that sells authentic blank kits if you buy a Battle for Baby kit for about $20 like I said they do get that low you just have to find it you just have to go on the right day because <laughs> they do get that low um, $20 kit $50 for them to paint you know so that's everything is always less than $100 so you just have to really just find reputable artists because they often offer their dows at a discounted price as they are new and just starting off usually almost all beginner artists don't charge $500 off the bat you know they gradually work up to that price when their work gets better sometimes <laughs> another one is buy boo boo babies i don't know why people don't want to buy boo boo babies queen bees babies and stuff she had a great video on this topic about boo boo babies i personally don't mind buying boo boo babies now that i've been getting a little more money and expanding my collection i do kind of want to get into the higher dows but i don't care if my baby has boo-boos on them it's kind of it's kind of sad because boo-boo babies get no love and they're like the cheapest route to go and sometimes what the artist or whoever selling them considers a boo-boo sometimes isn't even a boo-boo i love boo-boo babies um javen he was a boo-boo baby chandler is even a boo-boo silicone baby and i love him to pieces and you guys do too so you know just do do what you want and get what you love is basically what i'm trying to say if you love boo-boo babies get a boo-boo baby if your baby's in high quality let me put a quotation around that if your baby's in high quality 
who cares you know we collect these dolls for ourselves we don't collect for other people and if you are someone who's collecting to please other people or to please instagram or youtube and that's your only reason for collecting do you go ahead and do that but me personally i collect the babies i want and the babies in my collection i collect because i actually want them and i actually love them but i am selling some boo boo babies <laughs> just had a shameless plug I am selling boo-boo babies. It seems like no one wants them. I don't know if they're because they're boo-boo, but I have no clue why they haven't sold. It actually, it's been taking a toll on me, honestly, if I'm being like 100% honest with you all. My camera battery is about to die. Let me switch it out really quick. And we're back. I don't even want to jinx by saying anything about the ring light. Um, It has been making a small toll on me. I haven't been trying to let it take me down too much, but I'm always like, how come my baby isn't so selling how come so-and-so baby selling or this person just posted this baby and it's sold in the same day or a few days later you know so like i always do that and it does make me feel a certain way that's beside the point um buy a boo-boo baby buy what you want that was my only tips that i had there's tons of people selling boo-boo babies like seriously everywhere you look there's a boo-boo baby and there's nothing wrong with them so that's another way to afford uh, an authentic reborn um, but that was all of my tips that I have. Save your money until you're able to afford a baby you really want. I have a video out on how to earn and save money. If any of you who's like, I just don't know how to save. I don't know how to earn. I have a video out for you all on tips and tricks on how to earn money as a teen, as anybody, honestly, and how to save money as a whole. It's not just for teens. It's not for grown ups. It's for everybody. So yeah, save your money until you're able to afford a baby that you really want. That's my biggest. If you don't want, if you don't like the options I gave you, the best thing to do is to save your money so that you can get a baby that you really, really want. That's really the only thing I can say. If you don't want to waste money, just save your money until you're able to get a baby that you really want. That's my tips for everybody. Um, I think that's everything that I had to say. Look at Eilina. But that's it for this video. If you guys want to follow me on instagram go ahead and follow me at my underscore reborns i am on reborns.com under melanated babies and i do have a membership which i have to talk to you guys about that i'm actually going to be closing my membership i might as well just say it but i'll get into it i'll get in more into it later if you guys look at her she's so cute she's saying hi guys you haven't seen me oh don't fall girl you guys haven't seen me in a while okay i don't like to pull at her all right, if you look at her, push that down. It's giving hawk. If you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below anything you want in the comments, including video requests. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, what are you doing? Click that subscribe button. Also, ring that bell so you guys will not be notified when I post another video. All right, Maya's out. We'll talk to you guys later. Bye. I wanted you guys to exit off with Eileen's cute face instead of my ugly hand. Bye, guys.